I don't often get the call to say, would you like to create an interior using old masters? I mean, that's a dream project. What I loved about working with Sotheby's is the ability to work with such an amazing collection. I have always loved old masters from the time I was very young. And there's something so wonderful to be surrounded by pieces that speak to you. The discovery of where it works well is so exciting and fun. As a designer, I think I'm a good listener. I like to interpret what I'm hearing, but then try and reinvent it in a way. I think sometimes the downfall is to think that there's something expected, that there's a right answer. Design is more about dreaming and imagining the possibilities and tapping into the magic that can be created through space and art, and I enjoy that challenge. I really try and encourage clients not to buy for a wall. It's more about a collection. I love the juxtaposition of old masters and a contemporary home. This extra layer of depth, texture, color, mood. It doesn't mean the walls have to be dark, the lighting has to be dim. On the contrary, you just work with the pieces as if they were part of the family. It's so natural to live with beautiful paintings of another time. The Van Dyke definitely spoke to me. That was my first love. There was a power to his presence, the depth and the strength and the soul. When art can touch your soul, that's exciting. I believe art should not be put up in a way that suggests don't touch. I think it should be part of one's home and personal space. That interior of the Lancre was so inviting, it just felt at home on top of the mantle. And some pieces just have that power and how surprising it is that the moments in these paintings are all so relatable. The two Canalettos, when you look at them, they speak to the magic of another time, but still so relevant, their strength and the mystery of them. My clients who are younger and just starting out, they love the old masters, and it doesn't stop them from collecting more contemporary pieces. I'm very open to the mix, and I think it keeps the collection exciting and fresh and personal. What we created together at Sotheby's seems very natural. I've always been inspired from the past. I think as a designer, it allows one to dream about moving forward, and to move forward with a collection from the past. There's something really nice about that.